My name is Laura Klapphacke. I'm from Germany. I'm born in a horse family. My parents, they were doing horses since their whole life. And that's why or how I came into that. And love the horses. That's my passion. Yeah, to be honest, I'm sure if I didn't have my parents, I would not be where I am because they support me so much. They, like everything I know, I, I learned from them and from Franke Slotak. My mom is doing more flat work training with me and my dad and Franke Slotak are doing the jumping training. He gives me a lot of support and maybe when I'm not sure something, I just ask him and then he says, yeah, stay quiet, stay calm, you should do like this or like that. It's just so special. We walk the course and then, you know, sometimes you have kind of easy lines where it's no option. But the grey horse Quinn I have, he's very special with his kenta because he has huge kenta. So especially these kind of arenas are not so easy for him when it's a bit smaller. But then it's always like, ah, oh, what's the best for the horse? Yeah, to make life easy for the horse as much as possible. And Quinn I got February 2021, so not that long time ago. Yeah, and I was really lucky. Simon said to me, yeah, I think he suits you really well. And it's true, and now one year later, or actually last year already, he jumped so many five-star Grand Prix with me. And I also didn't expect it, but Simon always believed in him. I always believed in him. And then it's like this special bond, I think, is so important what you have with the horses. Club Hake with a tremendous double clear on her comeback in the Global Champions League. And that after a big shoulder injury, dislocated collarbone, that was a diagnosis. Last week was my first show after my shoulder injury, six weeks ago. Yeah, it, it was actually really unlucky and a bit stupid how it happened. I was doing thread work in the morning, Monday morning before Madrid, and then I was riding Quinn, the grey one, and, and I think he was feeling so good, he was really happy. So I entered the arena. And I thought, oh, he's a bit fresh, but okay. So I put my leg to the front, I want to tie the girls. And in that moment, I think he was so happy. So he started bucking with me, cantering over the place. And then another turn, the second left turn came, I was leaning to the inside. He bucked again, and then the saddle went so much to the, to the right. I was so close to the ground, that's why I fell with my head, my shoulder and my hip. Yeah, and then I dislocated my shoulder. Now, still after six weeks, I mean, the riding is okay, let's say, if I don't do too much and if the horses are not too strong. But like the mobility, flexibility, it's difficult still. Here is Laura Klapphacke on the Stallion Quinn by Ferdy. It's the seven in here and the front rail. 74 seconds time allowed and Klapphacke gets caught by the clock. Yep, just 0.21 of a second as Klapphacke also has the final fence down that Oxer. The last week and this week I didn't have so many expectations because it's okay, let's say, but it's still not where I want to be with my shoulder. So, to be honest, I go to the shows more to to enjoy what I do and to be part of it. And actually the, the horses, they are my passion. It's just my what I love to do. But I started a real estate company one and a half years ago with my brothers. So this is actually my focus and the horses are just the fun on the side. I want to keep the horses as my passion because I think if it's your passion, you're better than if you go to the stable in the morning and you you think, I have to ride eight horses a day, you know? And I go in the stable half day, ride a few horses, uh, really enjoy the time. And the other day, I, I'm with my real estate business. We just finished to build uh, two, like four houses, actually. So this was our first big project. Now we're working on another project. It's a lot sometimes, but the good thing is I can kind of make my own plans. Like if I have an important show, then I can train. And then if I have no show, then I can focus more on the real estate. All this together, I think, makes me very happy.